Judy is dog sitting a dog and she lost it. She lost Johnny the dog. Johnny and Knoxville! First to you, Johnny, Clay has this multitude of layers that we kind of unpack throughout the show. How did you kind of prepare for the role? Well, first of all, can I say, and I'll answer your question in 27 seconds. Judy is dog sitting a dog and she lost it she lost johnny the dog. and knoxville don't i did not lose the dog yes the dog you, is no the dog is right here it. she just found it don't leave your dog with judy greer um she was sitting at my front door i did just almost have a heart attack but to your answer uh to prepare for the role i think life prepared me for the role a foul mouth comedian who, you know, overdid it every now and then. Like, yeah. Did I have to look that far? <laughs> uh, reboot is essentially two shows within one. Was it hard flipping that switch from one character to another, even though they're kind of eerily similar? No, we did um, a lot less flashing back than I thought we were going to. Yeah. Like, like I only read the first one or two scripts maybe before we started working, but um, I thought we were going to be shooting the show within a show a lot more and, and flashing back a lot more. And we really didn't. So thank God, because yeah, I think that would have been a lot for me to understand. And I'd have to color my hair all the time. Oh boy. If there's one thing Johnny hated, it was having to make his hair darker again. I mean, the hair looks incredible. I mean, he looks great right now. You know what I mean? I love it. Thanks. Yeah. It looks, it looks real, really... right? It looks real. It is real. Oh, oh. You're really great. <laughs> <laughs> Mine is uh, not real. <laughs> <laughs> John, it looks like, like the entire show looks like it's a whole lot of fun. Was there some flexibility within you guys' dialogue from what was script to what was on the screen? Well, well I mean, sure, I think. Steve, Stephen and the writers, Stephen would give us that latitude, but I, we didn't need it because the scripts are so great. Uh, and he throws out, they throw out so many great alts. It's like, they, they're doing all the work for us. Yeah, we don't have to do anything. Nope. Thank God. Still up, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sometimes we don't do that that yeah. well. <laughs> Uh, Judy, I've got a fun one uh, here before we go. We've seen plenty of shows get quote unquote rebooted over the last few years. What show is that hasn't been rebooted? Rebooted? Would you like to see rebooted? God, there's a lot of rebooted in that rebooted, question. Rebooted. Sorry. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know. The shows I loved um, that I would want to watch again. All the cast members are dead, so I wouldn't say those because I like I like when shows come back with the original people. Um, so I don't know, I guess like, they just don't make them like they used to. I was going to say like Hill Street Blues or Homicide, but they would find a way to make it weird. And what was cool about those shows was like how greedy and raw they were. And, and probably also that has to do with shooting on film and now I'm just getting techie, but you know, like in the digital age when we're shooting on digital and these cards, you just, it's hard. It takes a lot of time and money to make something look like that kind of edgy and raw. Mm -hmm.